A task force to make the streets safe in Cochise County is up and running, and according to officials, they are already making progress. News for Tucson's Lupita Murillo has the story. Highway 92 has been the hotbed for high-speed chases. The Cochise County Sheriff's Department says they average anywhere between two and ten chases a day. It's just crazy. I mean, like I said the other day, I saw one right here at my work while I was working, and you just see the, it was, I think, a white charger just hauling up bud, and you see the border patrols and highway patrol going after them. The Safe Streets Task Force has been added a few weeks. A cool FM online radio listener shot this video. The radio station shared it with News 4 Tucson. It shows a deputy making a stop. The driver taking off, the deputy says he was dragged. Sheriff Daniels says the driver was arrested, charged with numerous felonies, and had eight undocumented immigrants in his vehicle, including a child. In a separate incident... It's scary when you have a 16-year-old driving 120 miles an hour at 9 o'clock at night in the opposite lane. It puts us in huge risk as law enforcement. Not only is law enforcement at risk, but so is the public. This woman, who asked not to be identified, told News 4 Tucson. We always have a high-speed chase on Highway 92. Yeah, because they usually are trying to get away from Border Patrol, and so, of course, that's what's happening. So it's putting all of our lives in danger, anybody that's driving on Highway 92. Another resident told News 4 Tucson. Sometimes pulling over doesn't do any good because... It's a crazy situation. They, they just don't stop until they catch them. And if innocent people pay the price. Officials tell News 4 Tucson one woman died in October. A 14-year-old girl was critically injured when she was ejected from a vehicle that rolled while fleeing deputies. For Victor Flores, he says he's very careful when he leaves work. I could be coming out and... Out of nowhere, get hit. You never know what could happen. Sheriff Daniel says he knows the task force is working. In the last month, they've apprehended 157 illegal immigrants. In Sierra Vista, Lipita Murillo, News for Tucson.